Hello everyone! Welcome to Math Corner. In this video, we will divide polynomials using long division. Let us begin by dividing 3x plus x squared minus 8 by x minus 2. In this expression, 3x plus x squared minus 8 is the dividend, x minus 2 is the divisor. We need to arrange the dividend and the divisor in descending powers of the variable. We need to write them in standard form. The standard form of the dividend, 3x plus x squared minus 8, is x squared plus 3x minus 8. x minus 2 is already written in standard form. If there is any missing term in the dividend, we need to write the missing term having 0 as the numerical coefficient. Let us write inside this long division symbol the dividend x squared plus 3x minus 8. Outside is the divisor x minus 2. Let us divide the first term of the dividend by the first term of the divisor. x squared divided by x or x raised to 1 is equal to x raised to 2 minus 1 and it is equal to x. x is the first term of the quotient. Next step, multiply x by x minus 2 x times x is equal to x squared, x times negative 2 is equal to negative 2x. Next step, let us subtract. x squared minus x squared is equal to 0. 3x minus negative 2x is equal to 5x. Bring down negative 8. And then, we will repeat the process. 5x divided by x is equal to positive 5. 5 times x is equal to 5x. 5 times negative 2 is equal to negative 10. Let us subtract. 5x minus 5x is equal to 0. Negative 8 minus negative 10 is equal to positive 2. The quotient is x plus 5 and the remainder is equal to 2. We can write the answer as x plus 5 plus 2 divided by x minus 2, where x plus 5 is the quotient, 2 is the remainder, and x minus 2 is the divisor. Next example, 2x raised to 4 minus 19x squared minus 6 plus 5x divided by x plus 3. In standard form, the dividend is 2x raised to 4. Since there is no x cubed, we will write plus 0x cubed minus 19x squared plus 5x minus 6. And the divisor is x plus 3. Let us write x plus 3 outside this symbol. And inside is the dividend 2x raised to 4 plus 0x cubed minus 19x squared plus 5x minus 6. Let us divide 2x raised to 4. Divided by x, the answer is 2x cubed. Let us multiply 2x cubed times x is equal to 2x raised to 4. 2x cubed times 3 is equal to positive 6x cubed. Let us subtract 2x raised to 4 minus 2x raised to 4 is equal to 0. 0x cubed minus 6x cubed is equal to negative 6x cubed. Bring down negative 19x squared plus 5x minus 6. Let us repeat the process. Negative 6x cubed divided by x is equal to negative 6x squared. Negative 6x squared times x is equal to negative 6x cubed. Negative 6x squared times 3 is negative 18x squared. Let us subtract. Negative 6x cubed minus negative 6x cubed is equal to 0. Negative 19x squared minus negative 18x squared is equal to negative x squared. Bring down positive 5x minus 6. Negative x squared divided by x is equal to negative x. Negative x times x is equal to negative x squared, 
negative x times 3 is equal to negative 3x. Let us subtract. Negative x squared minus negative x squared is equal to 0. 5x minus negative 3x is equal to 8x. Bring down negative 6. 8x divided by x is equal to positive 8. Positive 8 times x is equal to 8x. 8 times 3 is equal to 24. Let us subtract 8x minus 8x is equal to 0. Negative 6 minus 24 is equal to negative 30. The quotient is 2x cubed minus 6x squared minus x plus 8 and the remainder is negative 30. We can write the answer as 2x cubed minus 6x squared minus x plus 8 minus 30 divided by x plus 3. Last example, let us divide x raised to 4 minus 3x cubed plus 10x squared minus 18x plus 24 by x squared plus 6. The dividend and the divisor are already written in standard form. Let us write x squared plus 6 outside the long division symbol. And inside, we have x raised to 4 minus 3x cubed plus 10x squared minus 18x plus 24. Let us divide. x raised to 4 divided by x squared is equal to x squared. Let us multiply x squared by x squared plus 6 x squared times x squared is equal to x raised to 4, and x squared times 6 is equal to 6x squared. Let us subtract x raised to 4 minus x raised to 4 is equal to 0. We will bring down negative 3x cubed. We have 10x squared minus 6x squared is equal to positive 4x squared. And then we will bring down negative 18x plus 24. Let us divide negative 3x cubed by x squared. The answer is equal to negative 3x. Negative 3x times x squared is equal to negative 3x cubed. Negative 3x times 6 is equal to negative 18x. Let us subtract negative 3x cubed minus negative 3x cubed is equal to 0. We will bring down 4x squared. Negative 18x minus negative 18x is equal to 0. And then we will bring down 24. Let us divide 4x squared by x squared. The answer is equal to 4. 4 times x squared is equal to 4x squared. 4 times 6 is equal to 24. Let us subtract. 4x squared minus 4x squared is equal to 0. 24 minus 24 is equal to 0. The quotient is x squared minus 3x plus 4 and the remainder is equal to 0. We can write the answer as x squared minus 3x plus 4. And that is how to divide polynomials using long division. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching.